Hi, welcome to Ike Penny, where we're saving the earth one tip at a time. I need to find a way of not using these disposable microwave bags to heat camping dinners. I'm going to try some silicon bags. So if you go to the previous dehydration video, I put the dehydrated meals in these zip wave bags, which often can't be cleaned easily, so have to be disposed. So you're using a new bag every second or third time or something like that. So I'm going to try these silicon bags off eBay. They weigh about 130 grams, so they're heavier than these bags, so I'd probably have the meal in reusable Ziploc bags and just bring one of these camping, put the meal in there, add the boiling water and then wash this while I'm at the camp, so you're only using one of these. So fairly heavy to have multiple ones of these. So this is freezable, microwavable according to the manufacturer on eBay. So let's give it a go. So for camping I'd normally boil the billy on the metho stove, but we're at home so I'll just use a kettle. So the top here just slides off. And there's your silicon bag. So I'm just going to pour the meal. This one's sweet potato and eggplant curry. So there'll be a link in the description for the dehydration meal the video if you want to see how to do these. So that Ziploc bag will be washed and reused. The rice goes in a separate bag so it's a bit spiky and that can damage the bag so if you don't double bag it. Rice goes in there. So at camping you just add your dehydrated meal to that, add the hot water and then 250 mils or one cup of hot water and leave it to soak. Kettle's boiled, 250 mils of boiling water, pour that into here. Seal that up, it's got a little arrow here. Push it on the direction of the arrow. So you need to leave this to soak for 20 minutes. So I've got another little insulation bag. Quite easy to cook at camp. Put the boiling water in, leave it to soak, and wait 20 minutes. So it fits in there. And just like that, 20 minutes is up. Let's see how this is cooked. And sort of jiggle the bag a bit. Take it out of the insulated. Insulation bag. Give it a bit of a squish up. I'll do a taste comparison compared to the previous bags. Mm. I'd say pretty much the same. So I'll eat this out of the bag, same as the way you do it at camping, and I'll see how easy it is to wash these out afterwards. Yeah, I've just given it a few quick rinses with a minimal amount of water. It's pretty easy to clean. So I'll try them out next time at camping and see how I go. 
when you're eating from them you can have the bag quite wide apart like that so it's easy to use a spoon the other ziplock bags are sort of tight at the top and it's hard to get your spoon in these you can open them nice and wide so at camp I'd just rinse that out dry it out and keep it for the next dinner for the next night